Hey, how's it going, Yankees fans? Quick heads up. There's a website called The Inquisitor that is pumping out fake news. And it's winding up on the Google News search. So if you type in Yankees, it pops up. An author that goes by the name of Jonathan Vatkin is collaborating with a Twitter account called MLB Insider, which is a fake account who claims to be an insider. He's similar to a username by the name of Chris Evans or John Evans, something like that, that popped up and made news headlines as being fake. So this is making the rounds now. Hal Steinbrenner did not request a meeting with Bryce Harper, but in the perfect world, he should have. But um, this is fake. So just a heads up. The Yankees front office, Hal Steinbrenner in particular, has stated that the Yankees are done. They have a whole bunch of bills, specifically paying the new stadium off, etc. In Brian Cashman's words, they put that money into being diverse. So they got LeMahieu to the whiskey, signed Britton, Ottavino, re-signed Gardner, Sabathia, etc. So if you see this making the rounds, because it is, because it's showing up in Google News, it's fake. Hal Steinbrenner did not offer... Bryce Harper, any contract, he did not request a meeting with Scott Boris, and it's fake. There's a whole bunch of Twitter accounts now spreading false information, and then you have authors like this Jonathan guy writing articles. Supposedly, maybe he thinks it's real, but I believe he's doing it for the clicks. Hey, you guys know me. I like Bryce Harper. I think the Yankees should have went out there and signed a big left-handed bat. But like I said, we don't live in the age of the boss anymore. We live in the age of Hal Steinbrenner. And this is how he's running the Yankees. So, Yankees fans, leave your opinions in the comment section below. And like always, this has been Felix from nynews.com. Share, like, and subscribe, and I will check you out next time.